Hey guys, it's Pixel Drew here, and welcome to a new video. This is about Hollow Realization, the new Sword Online game coming out. And there were some new videos leaked on the internet. Well, they weren't leaks, but they were put on the internet. And there are two concept art one of Kirito's new design and one of Asuna's new design. Now, I will start with Kirito's. There's a picture now, a picture of here. And yeah, as you can see, it looks fairly similar to his old SAO one. I mean, uh, he's still got the wearing the black, because of his colour. He's got the long coat. The, trousers and the boots. It's got the same hairstyle. And you can notice that it's a bit less dark than the original. That might just be because of the colouring and the concept art. But it's not as black. It looks more brownish. And you can tell the bit on his trousers is not as dark. But the shirt is pure black. Like The shirt's pretty dark. You can tell the inside of the collar seems a bit white. That looks pretty nice. And also I've noticed something just now. If you look where the sword is, there's only one sword. Does that mean you won't have a dual wielding anymore? I kind of hope he does, but I hope you have to unlock it. I kind of how he did in the anime. Like I know you're starting from floor one when you're not starting on any floors. Or flat, but you're starting from level one. So he's not going to have had that straight away. He's got some nice fingerless gloves and he's got a nice blue strap across. It looks like his um, outfit in the original. Like his original avatar outfit when before he was actually turned in to look like himself in real life. It looks kind of like that, mixed with the midnight coat, with the blue and then the uh, greyish. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. Is there anything else there? His boots, they're a bit shorter, I think, than the others. And yeah, and there's a lot less white than the original, which is a bit strange. Okay, so now we go off to Asuna. Asuna's looks kind of like a pirate, I guess. Like her original. Now, what does she have from her original? So, she doesn't have as long of a coat. She doesn't have the big long coat that she's have. Uh, there's no weapon on there. She doesn't have any Knights of the Blood Oath icons, because I guess that's because they don't exist anymore. She also doesn't have any metal plating like she used to. It's more like levery in the middle, that chest area. Like the straps and stuff. It looks pretty nice. Her skirt is a bit short. It looks like a Lost Song outfit. A bit. Yeah, it looks like a lost song outfit. She's also got um, on her arms. She's got kind of her when she was Titania, her fairy outfit, but not when she was Undine, her old fairy outfit in season one. It's kind of got the arms like that, and uh, the back's kind of like more revealed than her original because she was wearing a big coat. And yeah, it's pretty much. It looks pretty much similar. It's got the same red and white theme. I've seen that's a lot of colours. It looks like she's wearing high heels more, whereas in the original she wore shoes. These look more like high heels, so. Yeah, and the socks aren't as... I don't know, the socks look pretty the same. But they just look different because they're not as high. The skirt is more frilled than the rest of it. And it's kind of got a red bit. It looks pretty nice. It's also got a bit of yellow on there, which is good. So her original outfit was just white and red, and it was kind of boring. It kind of looks like her um, outfit from Infinity Moment as well, so that's quite cool. Don't know what Infinity Moment is, the one that Hollow Fragment is based on. I'm just the Iron Crest area. So yeah guys, that's the two bits of concept art that were shown today. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment. And if you want to hear more about this new game coming out, subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon for when more concept art is released. Thanks guys.